Yeah, Control, can I get talked through with the Scalectrics Police Department, please? Go ahead. Yeah, any Sierra Papa Delta units receiving? Sierra Papa Delta 1 receiving, go ahead. Yeah, Sierra Papa Delta 1, contrary to the Scalectric Road Traffic Act 2023, we have yet another speed in Carrera car on a Scalectric track. A warm welcome back to the channel, everybody. Lights on. Oh. Oh, my. G oh, my. Do you know what? Round of applause. Round of applause. How beautiful does this look? Carrera, what are you doing to me? Scalectric is my favourite slot car brand, not you. Stop tempting me. Oh my goodness, this is gorgeous. <laughs> now this one was harder to get. I had to get this imported from Germany, believe it or not. And my goodness, it looks even better in the flesh as it were. The, the photos do it very good justice, but actually seeing it with the naked eyes, oh my gosh. And as always, can we have a quick look at the case? If I haven't said it before, I'll say it now. Nobody, and I mean nobody, in the slot car producing world beats Carrera when it comes to presentation and their cases. But again, look, look at all of that, what you get. And in here is a nice little package, a nice little package of accessories and spears and all sorts of goodies. Now again, because this is a Carrera car, let's get it out of the case. Well, not fully out of the case because you don't just take this car out of the case fully and not appreciate its surroundings yet again. You can see that mirrored wall much better with the main cover off. How beautiful is this? And as a collector, I'm speaking as not only a fan of slot cars and someone new in this world, I'm speaking as a collector of model cars. If I showed you my normal model car collection, you'd be blown away. I could literally start a whole new channel, but I'm not gonna do that. It's all about <laughs> slot cars for me. And I'm telling you, even if you were into slot cars, what a beautiful model to have as a collection. People! This is the Carrera Audi R8 LMS BWT. This is the Motorsport number 25 version. Now, oh my goodness. You would have noticed that I've missed out a word because I'm not sure how to pronounce it. Let me give you what it says on the actual display. It says Audi R8 LMS BWT. And then there's a word that looks like mucky or muke. I don't really don't know. Anyway, motorsport number 25. And do you want to know why I had to get this one sent over here from Germany? I absolutely love the BWT livery. I first saw it in Formula One. And then when I saw this baby online, I thought, oh, wow. And it's a slot car. I've got to get this. And here it is. And when I say I'm a fan of the BWT livery, I really am. I started my collection of the BWT livery on vehicles a while ago, starting with this little baby right here. Now, if you're like me and you only have a Scalectric track, never fear, Scalectric fans. You can run this baby on a Scalectric track, as I have demonstrated with my first Carrera car, with a very simple and quick mod that does not involve you opening the car at all. I made the mistake of opening the first one thinking I had to do that to change the guide blade. You don't. It's literally pull, plug and play. Wow. I'll show you that very shortly. But can we just appreciate the detail on this Carrera model? It has a reverse polarity switch, which I found out was a very useful thing when I found out the hard way what the switch really does. I put the first Carrera car on my Scalectric track. I lined it up with a Scalectric car, ready to race it because I don't know if you know, even though I don't have a digital track, my track is also controlled by an app, funny enough. So it kind of makes it digital in a weird sort of way, but not really digital, but you can set one car running on its own with this app, believe it or not, on an analog track. So I had a Scalectric car and a Carrera car ready to race. The Scalectric car shot off and the Carrera car shot off too, but backwards. <laughs> I 
was like, what the hell? And then I realised that is what this little switch here is for. You flick that if you're going to run it on a scale electric track and your car will run in the correct direction. Nice. Right, so before we put this on the scale electric track, let's have a look at this beautiful Carrera car. Starting with the wheels. As always, Carrera wheels and tyres and everything, they look quality. However, the professionals out there, they tend to always whip them off and put a different set of tyres on because those are the professionals. I'm a noob, okay? <laughs> anyway, lovely alloys, loving the little bit of pink accent it's got on the uh, spokes, nice. And as always, there's a little caliper on each brake disc. Good, good. But I have to keep coming back to that livery. It is so beautiful. You've got the big BWT logo right there. You've got all sorts of livery on there. I'm not going to go through it all. You can see it for yourself. It's gorgeous. Let's have a look at some of the features. Stunning looking headlights. Loving the grille at the front with a bit of livery on there too. Very nice. You've got your Audi badge right there nice huge vent on the hood right there just like its real counterpart how gorgeous does this look from above <laughs> again absolutely loving the livery tiny little antenna there very nice look at all the detail that they're giving you on this carrera car and don't get me started on the rear windscreen not only do you have some super cool i don't know if you can pick that up there's literally cutouts there and there so that's a super vent right there on its own and then the elephant in the room look at that engine the detail and i'm loving how each section has its own sort of color there's black there's sort of silver chrome there's red that is awesome and look at that roll cage that all fits in with the theme of the livery and i love it and oh my goodness, now this is where Carrera goes one step further than the other brand that I love. Look at the driver. So apart from the fact he has on a helmet, check, just like the other brand. Look at his clothing, hello. Even his arm there, look. It's got the BWT branding on his clothing. And then don't get me started on even more detail. If you look on either side of his head, I believe that's part that makes up part of the sort of headrest or head support. But look, you can even see that right there. And it's got some livery on it. Come on. Oh my goodness, Carrera. I'm in love. I am in love with Carrera. And now viewers, can I draw your attention to the rear of this beautiful specimen right here? Look at the tiny delivery, delivery? <laughs> the tiny livery detail you've got right there around the wheel arch. And then this awesome looking spoiler, or if you like, rear wing. Not only does it have the big BWT livery right there with the different colored sections, very nice, but look underneath. I mean, they could have left that black or blank or whatever, or just make it a solid color underneath that spoiler. But they've literally carried on the uh, branding, the livery right there. And that is what I call attention to detail. 10 out of 10, Carrera. Oh, I could just stand here and stare at this beauty all day. I mean, look at the little vents there and the bigger one there. And then look at the rear of this vehicle beautifully neat rear working lights and look at those little exhaust pipes right there the diffuser the little livery going around here the audi badge and what is that is that more vents is that representing more vents yes it is those are the rear vents right there oh my goodness this is gorgeous now if i want to run this baby successfully on my scale electric track I need to change that blade and the good thing about Carrera, inside this compartment here are some goodies. And one of those goodies is this little red blade, which is more suitable for a scale electric track. Now to put this on, all I have to do is get a good grip on that big Carrera blade right there, pull it out and plug in the red one. And possibly flip that switch if this car runs backwards. <laughs> and that's it. So let's do it. 
And there it is, as simple as that. It is now Scalectric Track ready. Control, can I get talked through with the Scalectrics Police Department, please? Go ahead. Yeah, any Sierra Papa Delta units receiving? Sierra Papa Delta 1 receiving. Go ahead. Yeah, Sierra Papa Delta 1, contrary to the Scalectric Road Traffic Act 2023, we have yet another speed in Carrera car on a Scalectric track, specifically the Mike Steckendoys and Slot Cars Highway. Requesting your assistance. Yes, yes, on my way, ETA 03. Hey, buddy, what we got? Oh, hey, yeah, we've got another career car breaking the speed limit, and he shouldn't be on this highway anyway. It's a Carrera car. Okay, I know a few shortcuts. I'm sure you do too. Let's do what we do best. Let's get ahead of him and we'll stop him. We'll try and stop him on the flyover by the Carrera building. Fafa, game over, buddy. Turn off your engine, step out the vehicle. Um, yeah, what he said. Okay, okay, I'm turning off my engine, I'm stepping out of the vehicle, but hey, career cars have rights too, you know. <laughs> Whatever, shut up, and are you the registered owner of this vehicle, sir? It's a solid... 9.9 .9 out of 10 for me.